Hey loves, it's Full and Celine and the Rick, hubby. Ricky V. <laughs> so for today's video, we wanted to sit down and share with you guys how we told our family that we were pregnant. This video is long overdue. We actually filmed this video a really long time ago. Yeah, when it was too grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> you were grumpy, not me. <laughs> Ricardo was just not she feeling was it. Camera shy, doing like. Wow. She was doing this a lot. <clears throat> she couldn't edit it out, so we're back. Me, right? <laughs> we're back. <laughs> so we're back. And I was trying to edit that footage so that I'd include it in Baby Week, as I told you guys over on Instagram, sharing with you guys like the IVF journey and also the announcement of when we told our friends and family and then we were gonna do the gender reveal. That's why that video is not up yet. That is coming, that will be the next video, um, the gender reveal, but we wanted to film this part first. So uh, we're just gonna think back of a few months ago when we first told our friends and family that we were pregnant. Do you wanna start off who we told first? Um, who did we tell first? Your family, right? So yes. can share. Yes, so when we were going through the end of the process of IVF, this was just like the waiting period to find out whether we were pregnant or not. We actually found out, was it the day before or a few days before? I want to say it was like a, a few days before, so I can't tell you if it was a day before, but it was a few days before. Right, it was like it was a few like days right, before. It was right before we left, you could say that. Right, so we had planned a vacation to go to Disney World, and this was like a year in advance that we planned it. Mm -hmm. And so we went with my family, which is my sister, my brother-in-law, their two children, and my mom. And we were all together, and we were going to tell them in a really fun way, but... We had to figure something out last minute because we didn't realize at that moment, we are like, wait a second, we're gonna go to all these rides where there's a lot of turbulence and I'm not gonna be able to get on. So we're gonna have to figure something out. So we did already have something in mind, right? Go to that now. <laughs> Belinda's pregnant on three. One, two, three. I gotta figure out what you were doing there. <laughs> hey! <laughs> <laughs> Disney World, we wanted to make sure that we told his family immediately. The first people that we went to go visit was his mom because we went to pick up our dogs since she does sit for us. She takes care of the dogs when we're away. So we stopped there and then his brother was also there. And so we brought them back a souvenir from Disney World, the keychains that say, uh, what did they say? So the one for my mom said grandma and she's not a grandma yet. Right. And then my brothers, who are not Theos yet, said Theos. Yeah, so this is the first grandchild on his side of the and, family. And, my, and we got a grandpa for, for my dad. dad. Yeah, and in my side of the family, there's two grandchildren. So for them, they were like, gonna be like, wait, what? Like, we're not Theos, we're not grandma and grandpa. So mm. I, we thought that was cute. Um, so we gave it to his brother and to his mom. And his mom had the best reaction. <laughs> Insert clip now. <laughs> All right, I feel so unprepared to give the announcement that we're going to be pregnant. We just came back from Orlando yesterday. We didn't really know what to get Ricardo's mom for a surprise to tell her that we're pregnant just because when we were in Orlando we wanted to tell her as soon as possible once we found out that the pregnancy was like safe and that we were a little bit more far advanced um, and so we were talking about it and we said that we wanted to surprise her when we came back to pick up the dogs because she's taking care of our dogs while we were traveling and that way it wouldn't seem obvious that we were trying to give her a gift um, since we bring her back a souvenir from Disney World anyway. So so what I'm gonna do is we're going to wrap up the keychain. I also have like an Alex and Annie bracelet that I wanna give her and then I'll give her a card at the end that says um, your grandbaby's heart started beating and it has a picture of the ultrasound. 
I'm excited. I'm like nervous. I don't know why I'm so nervous. I don't think she's expecting it right now. Um, so that's like the best way to do it because otherwise she asks us like every other time if we're pregnant yet. So I know she's probably going to be excited to hear the good news. Look, it's cute, isn't it? Yes, it is. I could Thank you. And then we also got you guys these. What's this? It's your little souvenir from Disney World. Oh, it's a jam. Marcella doesn't want to be in it. Oh. Grandma! Grandma? Grandma? I'm not a grandma yet. What? Am I a grandma? She said on cloud nine, she was... She's uh, like, I feel like I'm on cloud nine. She was, I feel like I won a million dollars. She was like jumping up and down. Yeah. And I wish we had better lighting when we were doing it. But I was... She we was not be, like... We yeah. have to be discreet though. Like, yeah, with filming. We're not going to be like, here's a ring light. Nothing special happening. I was trying to make it as discreet as possible and not show the camera. Mm. And then... They wouldn't really know what's going on. So that was that was awesome. I loved her reaction. That was really fun. Um, after that, we held like a brunch at our house yeah. uh, for his other brother and his dad. My brother's girlfriend. And okay. well, now fiance. Fiance, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> and um, he put a ring on it. He did. <laughs> nice ring. And we brought them over. We're like, hey, we have some souvenirs for you guys from Disney World, and then they opened it. So you weren't sure if you what Disney character you like, but we knew you liked uh, oh, Game of Thrones. Hey, wait, wait, wait! I'm not a grandpa. What? I'm not a grandpa. You might be. <laughs> Soon. Really? Wow! Oh, my Dio, are you looking so <laughs> I was suspecting, but I didn't want to get my hopes up. <laughs> well, now you can. Mm. Oh my god, congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to be a Theo. <laughs> Ginger does not like it when people hug. <laughs> Have you noticed that? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. What really did surprise me though was your older brother. Like right. he cried and he doesn't really yeah, he ever cries. Like he was just really, really happy. And to me that was really surprising because I don't see him as an emotional person. So that really shocked me. I was like, wow, he's really happy and excited for us. And that felt so special. Mm -hmm. um, and then we told my dad and my dad already knew. He claimed to know. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I knew it, but I feel like we kind of gave it away. He kind of knew something was up, but I couldn't say, like, it's, I think it would be hard to connect with that. She knew something was off, but it's hard to say, oh yeah, she's pregnant. She could have been hurt. So we were shopping around for furniture in our house and I needed to complete a project so I needed to get furniture like that day. It was just like one piece, but it's supposed to be like I guess yeah, it's a small it's supposed yeah, to be like a, a small piece of furniture and it's and it's not heavy. We didn't think anything of it, but we're like we know Belinda can't be carrying like heavy things. Heavy things, but yeah. it's it's not like unimaginable that me and her can do it. 
Right. right? Like, but we could have easily carried it. But for it. us, it was like, we need your dad because, you know, you can't. And then I guess we didn't think of how kind of off that can look, but he always helps us with things so around mm -hmm. the house. So we kind of helped connect to that. But um, that's when he thought something was He's up. like, something's up. But, Linda can pick you know, this up. That was a couple of days maybe before or maybe before we went. I don't know when that was. We went. We took him out for his birthday. Oh. It was around, it was like in December, and we had planned to take him out for his birthday, and then part of his gift was the ultrasound picture. Happy birthday! Tengo tu regalo, quiero que lo abras. Oh, wow. Okay. Muy bonito. Wow. Yeah. Is Alright. Alright. Yeah, so yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, Tobias. Que este, que, que veíamos las, las casas para allá. Ajá. Y ahí ha escondido. <laughs> ¿Qué? ¿De qué? ¿Las casas? Que no puedes cargar pesado. Oh, oh. ¿Y se <laughs> <risa> Porque siempre, siempre yo estoy ayudando, ¿verdad? No, Ricardo, no me dejó cargar nada. Sí. We gave it away. Felicidades. Felicidades. Felicidades, Ricardo. Y este. Y este. Cuídense. Y no me dejes hacer nada. Ayer limpió toda la cocina. Y lo que falta. We are super close with his cousin and his wife. And I call her my prima. Her name's Sandy. And his cousin's name's Renee. And we're super, super, super close to them. They've been such a great support system through this entire journey. Uh, they knew that we were going through IVF. And they knew that eventually we would get pregnant. But they didn't know the specifics of it. Um, but she was always there for me when I was going through things and like I would cry to her and tell her like how I'm feeling and even though she didn't understand 100% what I was going through she was there to like just be there for me which was just so important and so we wanted to surprise them so we always have dinner dates and we had dinner at our house and we gave them their Christmas presents early mm -hmm. so it was really funny like I I just love that footage you guys saw it on vlogmas but I cut off the part of where she opened uh, the gift um, oh, yeah. right mm -hmm. where Sandy opened hers but we did oh, show some, Renee. shout out to somebody on the comments I think was like I think she's pregnant. Yeah, someone was like, wait a second, that hug at the end, right? Yeah, yeah about, someone got yeah, that, that hug. <laughs> wow, here, Renee, you get the biggest one. Today. One for me? Yeah. Just for you. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow, thank you. This is Jackie. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Wow, free stuff already. Hey. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Oh, nice. <laughs> what are they? What do they do? It's like a thermal top. Yeah, thermal. Thermal leggings. Okay. So those are the leggings. Okay. Like for the gym? Yeah. Coco. And... Ooh, some lashes. Ooh. Nice. Now, I mean, so we could cancel more that appointment. Dang. Dang. No more lash appointments. Dang. I mean, we better tell them. And some mascara for my lashes. <laughs> <laughs> nice. 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 Nice.
know. I don't think so. Okay. <laughs> the, the one from last week. <laughs> what, what did I oh miss? Oh my god! What happened? Did I get a card? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? For real? <laughs> and you said no one's crying, but now you are. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy! <laughs> Can I show Dang. the camera? Coco wants some. <laughs> This year has been extremely difficult physically and emotionally and couldn't have gone through it without you. Your love and support has kept faith in us and we created a little miracle that we will soon call you Thea. We are pregnant. Oh my god! Nice! Congrats! Oh my god! Hang on, we should all take pictures with our hand on <laughs> Thank you for the gifts and congratulations. That's the best gift ever! <laughs> oh, congratulations. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, I'm so excited. Do you guys know why now she couldn't, so she couldn't eat? <laughs> 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 Maybe it's not like burgers or salt. <laughs> <laughs> Probably the word salty. She just has heightened taste oh, wow. buds. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> What's the due date? Summer. In August. August. Oh, August. Oh, nice. Good weather. Yeah. That's perfect. That's amazing. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. <laughs> yeah, that's great. Um, another person that I made a really cute gift for was my best friend Ashley. She's my bestie. She also knew that I was going through IVF, so she kind of knew. She knows way more about it because she is in the medical field, so she knows all about the procedure. She helped me out with just going through the beginning stages, like everything in between. And so I made her a little box. Made on my Cricut machine it was a shirt and I printed it out for her. And then I put the ultrasound in there and I gave it to her. And that was really special. That was really nice too. Yeah, the rest of our family, we did it at... Uh, way we, later. Later, but because... There was a time, like like during Christmas, we already knew, but she wasn't far along enough that we were gonna tell everybody. But yeah. it was a little iffy. We wanted to, we didn't want to. We ended up not. Um, I made her fake cocktails. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's how we got away with it. <laughs> uh, I made a drink that didn't have alcohol, and I would put pour a shot in it. But I would give it to her, and they would think, "Oh, she's drinking with us." Right. Um, like, I think one of your cousins said, "I thought you were drunk." I was like, "Wow, uh, really?" <laughs> but there was my uncle and my. My uncle that we ended up telling uh, her mom's 50th actually said, like, on the drive back that she's yeah. pregnant. Yeah, it's like, I think Belinda's pregnant. <laughs> yeah. So just at uh, her mom's 50th, we just were, we're like doing the cake and then we we did the announcement up yeah. there with her mom. Um, I want to thank everybody for coming today and helping surprise my mom. I need a lot of <coughs> And como me, no se a ella, ahora this queremos hacer una surprise for ustedes. So since you guys helped us surprise my mom, we want to surprise you guys too, and we wanted to announce that Arcado and I are going to be expecting soon. Oh! That was really nice. I asked my mom. I was like, I don't know if I should make the announcement, mm -hmm. <laughs> even though it's your birthday. But um, she was so excited. So when we were cutting the cake, I was like, Mom, is it okay if I can announce to everyone? She's like, yeah, of course. She's like, yeah. So I was like, okay. So we announced it and everybody was so excited. I also told my boss um, at work. I'm really close to him. I've worked for him for over, I don't know, five years, six years. I don't know, for a long time. For a so long time. When I started my career, I started actually with him. I've, we've moved to different jobs. I've followed him twice now. Um, so it's about who you know. Um, so... <laughs> Um, I've been at this place for three years now, so I've been working with him, and so he's he's my, great. He's he's my boss, so he reviews a lot of my work, and so I gave him paperwork, um, so he's always reviewing it. So he flips through through it. I put it at the last page, 
and then when he flipped you through put, it, put an ultrasound. In yeah, the last put page? a picture in the last or the ultrasound in the last page, and he saw it, and he was so happy. And I thought that was a good way to tell him because he wouldn't know, and he's flipping through, and yeah. he saw it. So I cool. love him. He's so great. He yeah. was at our wedding. He was at our housewarming party, and it's so nice that like. He also gets to share that with him and he's so understanding when it comes to anything that has to do with my pregnancy. Like, he approved our vacation when we were going to go to Europe, remember, mm -hmm. for that long? Mm -hmm. uh, even though it didn't happen. Coronavirus! <laughs> <clears throat> and then, um, with my friends that I've actually caught up with, um, we worked at this company for like a year, but we became uh, best friends after that, just that one year. Um, some of them have worked together for a little bit longer, but... For the most part, we were there together for like, for at least I was there for a year. And so I've been invited to all their weddings. And so we're really close and we used to do like a lot more of these, but we used to go out and go to different places to eat different kinds of food on the weekend. And so- That's how they kept in touch. Mm -hmm. So even though they no longer work together, cause they all started working at different places, um, they still kept in touch, right? Yeah. Which is really nice cause- And we always keep yeah. up on WhatsApp and the, the WhatsApp group is called Them Boys cause we're Them Boys. <laughs> Um, so it lined up pretty nicely where it was the same weekend as, uh, her mom's 50th. Um, so yeah, we were at the, what's it called? Oh. Wasabi, I think, which is, a uh, It was ramen. a ramen place. It's ramen oh place. my God, it's so good. You know, later after we ate, I said, hey guys, I have an announcement. And I kind of told them there and they were, it was, it was so, so nice. Yeah. It was such a good feeling. And we have a nice picture if we could show that. That was really nice. It was so special that we're all able to celebrate our milestones together. And I find that so special in their friendship because even though they have... How long has it been since you guys haven't worked together? I mean, I haven't like, worked there for four years. Four, four, or five four years, years, but you guys yeah. still kept in contact? Like, that's crazy to me. Yeah, because we still... worked from nine to nine. So it was like we worked together for a lot longer. You guys got really and close. And we got close because we worked late hours. So it's like we knew each other more. Like, we were part of each other's life for that year more than anybody easily. Yeah, you know? like they saw him more than I saw yeah, him. Yeah, <laughs> like I was there until nine o'clock sometimes. And then that's it, right? That's all? That we like made it like a big thing where we told other people and then other people we just called. Yeah, called or texted and you know, all that yeah. other. Um, so we did make a lot of phone calls. We FaceTimed people and let them know and it was, it was really awesome. It was so amazing because I feel like a lot of people for a really long time were kind of just waiting or asked us constantly like, when are you having children? Yeah. Like, um, as, as blunt as you see already told you, it's, it was a long journey. So. Yes. It really, wasn't, really it wasn't, long. It wasn't for the fact that we weren't trying. Because um, <laughs> we were. Um, but we're happy, obviously. Yeah. yeah, that was awesome. Oh, I'm so glad. And now, like, you guys get to see this footage finally. <laughs> um, so Since one is in a better mood. <laughs> it was you! <laughs> <laughs> I should show him that clip. <laughs> you know what? Let me insert that clip of you being grumpy. Do it! <laughs> So that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. The next video going up is finally our gender reveal, which I'm so excited about. And I think you guys will be super excited too. So we'll talk to you guys next time. Muchos besos. Mwah.